Welcome! I've been wanting to do a video like this for a while, but I never really did it, so I'm doing a makeup video today. I'm just gonna be doing my normal routine of a full face of makeup. So let's get going! I'm starting off with the IQ Smooth Finish Primer, and I'm just gonna apply that all over my face. The next thing I'm gonna use is the Essence Stay All Day 16 Hour Concealer. And then I'm gonna blend it with a finger. I'm using the Max Factor Ellen Batrix foundation. For me that foundation works the best because it has a very light shade and it's it's neither pink nor is it orange. And I'm using a normal foundation brush. Is foundation done. For powder I'm using the Catrice Nude Illusion Loose Powder. It's a translucent one and I am also using a big fluffy brush. Then we're coming on to the fun part and that is contouring. I'm using the Essence Get Picture Ready Contouring Palette. For contouring I'm using the smaller brush of the one I used just before. Taking this shade then I'm taking the middle shade for temples, hairline and jawline. And then just with a clean finger, I'm taking the highlighting color. And the thing I like to do is I put it on the center of my eyelids just to brighten them up. We're gonna go on to eyebrows. Again, I'm using Essence. I'm using the darker one for my eyebrows and the lighter one to contour my nose and my eyes as well. First, I'm gonna use a spoolie and I'm just brushing my eyebrows with it. I'm then taking an angled brush with the dark color and then do my eyebrows. Once I'm happy with the shape, I call it a day because getting them to look the same is too difficult. I'm gonna use a fluffy brush and this color to contour my nose and my eyes. Up next I'm gonna be doing the eyes because I just contoured them and now it's time for black eyeshadow. I'm using a normal flat brush and the thing is I'm just gonna pop it around my eye line basically and I'm blending it out later with a fluffy brush so you don't have to be too careful if it's not entirely straight right now and then with a fluffy brush I am blending it all out now to give it all a bit more blackness I am using a Kajal pencil. It's the one from Primark, nothing special. I think that one works really well, so I like to use it. And I'm just gonna be lining my top lash line. This Kajal pencil comes with a smudge tip at the end, so this is what I'm gonna use. And then I'm gonna highlight the inner corners of my eyes. I'm using a highlighting brush. I am using the same highlighter I used before. I am also highlighting the brow bone. I'm gonna be curling my lashes and using the Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara. extra darkness I'm using the same Kajal pencil I used before and I'm just lining halfway of my waterline so we're gonna go on with cheeks I got this sugar bomb blush for my birthday at one point and I just cut it out of the package so it looks a bit rugged right now but I'm using 
this and the corresponding brush and I'm just putting it on the apples of my cheeks. And then my newest addition, which I'm very happy about, is my prismatic rainbow highlighter. And there's also a fan brush. For the lip, I'm using my chapstick. Just a thin layer. And then I'm using the Essence Matte Lipstick in number six. And what I'm doing is I'm just dabbing it. And because I just applied lip balm, I can smudge it easily. And then the last step is I have this eye tornado eyeshadow that is pink and glittery. And I'm dabbing my finger in it, just dabbing a little bit on the center of my lips to give it a bit of shine. The thing is, I don't like lip gloss because my hair always gets stuck in it. And so I like to add shine differently and that's how I do it. So this is a finished look. It is just an everyday look for me. So I like having black colors on my eyes. If you don't like it that black, maybe use a brown eyeshadow instead of a black one I used. This is what I usually wear if I do a full face of makeup. And yeah, I just thought I'd try something new with this video. Because I love makeup so much and I watch a lot of makeup tutorials on YouTube. So I thought, why not make my own? And here it is. I hope you enjoyed. I hope it was somewhat good. And I hope to see you soon. Goodbye.